first, fast, accurate. With Jennifer Copeland and Rick Schutt, you're watching WSBT 22 News at 6. Disturbing new details tonight in a South Bend woman's murder. A court document indicates cell phone records ultimately helped them get Alberto Cruz to confess that he strangled Alma Del Real. WSBT 22's Kelly Stebzinski is here right now. And Kelly, a lot of people wondering about a motive in this case. But Rick, court documents do not by any means spell one out. We are also getting a better idea of the timeline here. What happened the morning police say Cruz killed his friend? He's one of the first people police talked to, and investigators say the last one to see Alma Del Real alive. Six weeks after Del Real disappeared, the prosecutor charged Alberto Cruz with her murder. Court documents say Del Real went out with Cruz in South Bend on Saturday, April 11th. They left Studio Roomba together around 3 a.m. Sunday, April 12th. Cruz initially told police he dropped her off at home, then went directly to his own house and to bed. He talked with police about that night on a number of occasions. But this week, when investigators confronted him about his cell phone activating in Marshall County, at approximately 6.45 that morning, he changed his story. According to court documents, Cruz said members of a drug cartel kidnapped Del Riel. Then he said a gang kidnapped her. Finally, he told police he could take them to her body. Officers drove him to this road near Culver Military Academy where they found Del Riel's decomposing body. After that, Cruz admitted he'd gone inside Del Riel's home six weeks earlier. He told investigators the two argued, he pushed her down and believed she was dead. But while she was lying on the ground, court documents say Cruz told police he strangled her. Cruz also told detectives he and Del Riel were friends and had been for some time. Initially, he said he had no romantic interest in her, but admitted he'd spent most of the previous month with Del Riel to the point of ignoring his girlfriend. He also admitted he considered Del Riel to be extremely attractive and stated, she's too pretty for me. A pathologist positively identified Del Riel's body yesterday through dental records. Cruz is still sitting in the St. Joseph County Jail tonight, a judge not giving him bond. He's scheduled to appear in court for the first time for a video arraignment Tuesday afternoon. Jennifer. Kelly.